This stuff is horrible. For the last like year, two years, I don't know how long it's been. My video, they haven't been performing very well. If I was making videos to try to be popular or for money or something, I wouldn't be making the videos that I make and I would have stopped by now. So it's fine. Yes, I am wearing super long socks. Don't judge me. At the same time, to say that I don't care about how many people watch my videos would be a lie because as much as I like making videos for myself, the point is so you can watch them. But this channel is eight years old. That's almost half my age. And I was hoping it would be better off than it is now, but that's not what I'm trying to say. There's been a desire of mine to be a furry YouTuber. I got the shirt to prove it. And there was a time where videos of mine about furry topics would perform really well. But as of now, all my videos perform about the same. And YouTube is constantly yelling at me about how every video I upload is performing worse than the last one. It's been pretty frustrating. And honestly, it doesn't help the anxiety issues I have regardless. YouTube, by its nature, is constantly showing you other people who are doing better than you. And I'm going in the wrong direction. It has actually been really cool to have people I know, friends, acquaintances, have their channels take off. It's, it's surreal to see, but the anxiety part of me loves to take that and hold it over my head that I'm not good enough. It's really hard to be motivated to make stuff when you're not sure if you're doing a good job. And I don't know how I play into that. I don't know if my videos are different or worse than they used to be, or if I'm covering different topics. I should explain that there's videos I like making that I'm interested in and I'm passionate about, and then videos I'm not really interested in, but I make anyways in an attempt to attract viewers, which sounds gross. And I'm sure some of you might find that weird. Why would you do videos you don't want to do? A single video getting a lot of engagement and extra watch time could be the difference between my next video getting 200 views or 20,000. So making a video specifically to help the channel, it seems like a good investment. But looking back on my videos, my favorite ones are always the ones I wanted to make. And the ones where I cover things I don't care about are never good. So f it, I'm not doing it anymore. There isn't going to be any Dr. Phil. I'm not going to Photoshop screenshots from Zootopia. I'm not going to watch CSI or make a dumb video just because it's free related and I think it might get some clicks. Nobody's asking me to. To be clear, nobody's asking me to. If you like any of the videos I mentioned, I really appreciate it. It really means a lot to me. I'm just saying that in the future, I'm not gonna make a video unless I really want to because YouTube isn't gonna be my job for a very long time, if ever. Stuff like NCIS or Dr. Phil or poodling. You can only force yourself to make so many videos that are kind of related to furries before you start either losing your mind, repeating yourself, or you lose your mind. Um, possibly both at the same time. You ever have like a teacher go through the class rules and they like do it in a very accusatory way. So you're like sitting there feeling guilty, even though you haven't done anything. You're just like, all oh, right, I'm not going to plagiarize my own paper. Relax. I'm, I'm not trying to do that here. Nobody is asking me to do the videos I don't enjoy. But in the past, I've said that I need to do what I like to do. And then I end up falling into doing stupid stuff again because I can find some sort of reason to justify it. It's not like my content's going to change like the last several projects I've done, I've been very happy with, and I, I quite like them. Will there be a lot of videos about cameras? Yes. I understand that the videos that I make, if you don't like them, you don't have to stick around. I guess that's really the gist of it. In other news, I've opened up Avery.video to comments and creating accounts now. I'm trying to get like email notifications to work, which I'm very excited about because it will be great to have like a backup of these videos. That's not YouTube. Got some cool stuff coming up soon. So be sure to stay tuned for that. And big shout out to my Patreon supporters. I have some physical rewards that I'm working on that I'm very excited about and I think are going to be really cool. So stay tuned for that kind of stuff. All right.